So students, today we will study a new topic of AC fundamentals that is ohm factor. Ohm factor is very important term in electrical engineering. It is the ratio of RMS value to average value. That means if we denote the form factor as Kf, it will be RMS value of alternating quantity divided by average value of alternating quantity. As we know the RMS value of any alternating quantity, if we take for voltage, that means if we are calculating this for voltage, then it will be Vm upon root 2. As we know that RMS value of alternating quantity is maximum value upon root 2 and average value is denoted as 2 Vm by pi. That means twice the maximum value divided by pi. So this will be the formula of form factor. Okay. okay? And we can write Vm upon root 2 as this and 2 Vm by pi as 0 0.637 into Vm. Vm, Vm will get cancelled and the remain, uh, answer will become 1.11 that means form factor of any alternating quantity which is sinusoidal in nature is 1.11 that means the form factor of any sinusoidal wave is 1.11 so it is form factor now one new factor which is also very important in our electrical engineering is peak factor it is also known as crest factor okay so what is this it is the ratio of maximum value as its name is peak factor so it is ratio of maximum value to rms value okay so now the formula becomes and now we will denote peak factor as Kp and its formula will become maximum value divided by RMS value. Okay. Now again we are calculating this Kp for voltage quantities. So how can I write it? I can write this Kp as maximum value what is maximum value it is denoted by vm maximum value is vm and what is rms value the formula for rms value as we had already derived it it is vm upon root 2 that is maximum value upon root 2 this vm vm will get cancelled and this root 2 will get over and the answer will be kp is equal to under root 2 and the value of under root 2 we know 4.1.414 so what is our peak factor? Peak factor comes out to be 1.414. So students, always remember that form factor for sinusoidal quantity is 1.11 and peak factor for sinusoidal quantities, we are calculating both the quantities for sinusoidal wave only. Remember, it is very important that these are sinusoidal waves. The peak factor comes out to be 1.414. Thank you.